Pearl Tutorial Part 31 Uploading a script to your server To upload a CGI script, a Perl script to your server I would recommend um, a good piece of FTP software I have the Ipswich WS FTP Pro which is awesome now um, when you are ready to start trying out some scripts on your server you can save your script as either a .cgi script or a .pl now one special thing about uploading Perl scripts to your server is you must do it in ASCII mode not binary so on this piece of FTP software I have a, a transfer mode button where I can select ASCII binary or auto which is based on the file extension so I have mine set to auto so it knows if we have a PL or a .cgi extension that it will upload in ASCII mode so very important you must upload your scripts in ASCII mode okay so we have to upload our scripts into the CGI bin CGI dash bin now your CGI bin will usually be located in your public HTML folder so you must come into the CGI bin and you can upload scripts directly into that folder or you can create new folders inside that now one very important thing is when you create a new folder so let's make a new folder in this directory now we must do what's called schmod our folders and files now that is to to set the permissions of the folders and files whether they can write um, information or whether it's just to read etc so in this program I can right click select properties and then I've got this this window and this is where I can select the permissions now 755 is the number you want to mod your files and folders to your CGI Perl files and your folders too so you've possibly seen this sort of grid before anyway they're usually fairly similar so to get the number 755 it's basically this pattern here owner read write execute group just read and execute world just read and execute okay so that's we'll set the permissions of our folder and that will give it permission to write read execute etc so we click OK that's how we deal with a folder now let's upload our scripts to this folder so we upload okay so we have our two scripts now we must mod them too so we can select both of them I can right click choose properties 644 will usually be the default now we want to change that into 755 like so and then our scripts will be ready to run if they're not mod 755 they won't work 
So that's very important. So those are the most important steps in uploading Perl scripts to your server.